What's new in unicorn companies this week? Here are six that made notable moves. Zero Hash joined the Unicorn Club after a $104 million Series D funding round, reaching a valuation of $1 billion. The round was led by interactive brokers and included backing from Morgan Stanley, SoFi, and funds managed by Apollo. Founded by Brian Liston and Edward Woodford, Zero Hash is a crypto infrastructure startup that specializes in providing banks and fintech firms with the essential technology to offer blockchain-based products. Its mission is to be the bridge for large trusted financial brands into the new world of digital assets by providing secure and efficient underlying technology. Post Hog hit unicorn status after a $75 million Series E funding round, reaching a valuation of $1.4 billion. The round was led by Peak 15 partners with contributions from existing investors. Founded in 2020 by James Hawkins and Tim Glazer, PostHog is an open source SaaS platform that combines product and web analytics, session recording, feature flags, A-B testing, and a built-in data warehouse. Polymarket is raising a new funding round that would value the company at over $9 billion. Backed by Founders Fund, the company aims to cement its role as a leader in prediction markets. Founded by Shane Coplin, Polymarket lets users trade on the outcomes of real-world events, from elections and financial results to global affairs, turning collective insight into actionable, market-driven forecasts. Cerebrus raised $1.1 billion in a Series G pre-IPO funding round, bringing the company's valuation to $8.1 billion. The funding round was co-led by Fidelity and Atreides Management, with participation from other investors. Founded in 2016 by Andrew Feldman, Jean-Philippe Fricker, Michael James, Sean Lai, and others, Cerebrus is best known for its development of the wafer scale engine, the largest single chip ever built. The company plans to use the capital to expand its technology portfolio, boost U.S. manufacturing capabilities, and accelerate the expansion of its data center footprint. OpenAI reached a $500 billion valuation after current and former employees sold about $6.6 .6 billion in shares to a consortium of investors, including Thrive Capital, SoftBank, and Dragoneer Investment Group. Founded by Sam Altman, Elon Musk, Ilya Sutskever, Vicky Chung, and others, OpenAI is renowned for developing some of the world's most advanced AI models, such as the GPT language models powering ChatGPT, the image generator DALLE, and the text to video model Sora. Supabase raised $100 million in a Series E round at a $5 billion valuation, led by Axel and Peak 15 with participation from existing investors, highlighting strong confidence in its trajectory. Founded by Anthony Wilson and Paul Cobblestone, Supabase delivers an open source backend platform built on PostgreSQL. Its offering includes authentication, storage, real-time data subscriptions, edge functions, and self-documenting APIs. With support for vector embeddings, Supabase streamlines backend development through modular, scalable services tailored for modern applications.